Tevez is a mythical mountain for cyclists, but geologically speaking, it's truly spectacular. And that's because we can see the internal structure of the mountain. You can follow the layers, just like you can follow the road with its famous hairpin bends. Now, layers in rocks are bands of differences, like compositional, color, or hardness. You can see these layers really well here because of the hardness differences. They're deposited horizontally. That's how they start. But these are vertical. Based on how they look now, we can figure out how the Alpe Mountains formed. Let's zoom out for a second to see the bigger picture. The climb of the Alpe d'Huez zigzags up the mountain behind me. And on the left are the layers that I already showed you. Now, if you look carefully, some of those layers form an M shape. When rocks get smushed, they bend and buckle and create folds. And that M is just a small fold. Now, if you follow the layers, they bend back up vertically to the top of the mountain about a kilometer high and would continue onwards that way, but they've been eroded away. The whole Alpe d'Huez forms one massive fold. The reason for that folding is hidden below the surface and it's connected to a story that started long before the formation of the Alps. In the Jurassic, the continent was stretched, making big fault zones along which gigantic blocks of crust moved down. When this region sank below sea level, those big blocks were covered horizontally like a blanket by the layers we saw up there. Much later, the Alps formed by compressing those rocks and reusing those old fault zones, but this time in the opposite direction, pushing those big blocks back up. This pushed the blanket up too, forming those beautifully folded structures. The folding of the Alpe d'Huez is actually the fault of a deep fault. So on the Queen stage, let's see who is going to fold and who will bend without breaking as they climb over the beautiful geology of this year's Tour de France Femme. Hi, I'm Marie-Laine Audier, and I hope you've been enjoying these videos of the geology of the Tour de France Femme. We really enjoyed making them for you. There's more where that came from, but we can't do it without viewer support. So please consider clicking on the link, making a donation, and we really hope to see you again next year.